Beware, stranger. The dead aren't supposed to walk around. And they certainly aren't supposed to attack innocent loggers. The dead emerged from bone strewn Barrow. I was working when it started. I buried my axe and three of them, but they kept on coming. My family's still out there, and the countryside is crawling with those damn creatures. Can you check on my family? We have three logging cabins scattered around the bone-strewn crest. Look for my brother, my cousin, and my wife. I can sneak around, but I can't fight Draugr in this state. Please, make sure my family is all right. My wife Jaquil and I share the cabin farthest to the north. My brother Kurthor... We don't talk much. He keeps to himself in the cabin near the Way Shrine. And my cousin Agnadir lives in the cabin near the springs. I got my nickname because my eyes reminded people of the warm embers of a fire. I think fires are much prettier. You're walking, but you're not dead. You picked the wrong day to visit our camp, stranger. My husband, Selgard? Is he all right? Why isn't he with you? 
What of the others? Did you find my brother-in-law? My young cousin? Kain, have mercy on my family. Don't worry about me. Save your concern for the next dead thing that walks through that door. Did you find them? Is my family all right? Shores bones! Why did I offer shelter to those travelers? I should have known better. They seemed friendly enough, and we never turn away those in need. But they asked the oddest questions about Bonestrun Barrow. And they were much too interested in that old crypt. They wanted to know how old it was, how big it was. If it was dangerous. People visit the barrow from time to time. I didn't think anything of it until... I helped one of them steady his pack. Owen was his name, if I recall. A helmet spilled out. A covenant helmet. I should have done something then. Their leader, Valsent, he saw what happened. He thanked me and said it was time for them to depart. They headed out without another word. I knew something was wrong, but I was just happy to see them leave. They said they were going to Windhelm, but I watched them go. They headed toward the Barrow. I don't know, but it wasn't long after they entered the Barrow that the Draugr shambled onto Bonestrun Crest. Go see what those Covenant milk drinkers are up to. Maybe then my brother and cousin can rest in peace. Now, I need to see my wife.
Thank the gods. Please, you have to let me out of here. Please, get me out of here. I'm Owen Pavel. I'm part of an expedition that was sent to explore this barrow. My team was cataloging the ruins when the Draugr attacked. It was terrible. I locked myself in here for my own protection. Valsen killed the rest of our expedition. He killed every last one of them. Pull the switch to my left. It will unlock the cage and open the door to the ceremonial chamber. That's where Valsent is doing, God knows what. But please, don't pull the switch to my right. Nothing good. Please don't touch the right switch. Fine. Have it your way. It activates some sort of mechanism. This cage is some kind of sacrificial device. I beg you, whatever you do, leave the right switch alone. Thank you for setting me free. I'll never forget this.
I returned to Jaquild after you went to the Barrow. We've been hiding in here. Did you find those Covenant milk drinkers? Did you stop them? Then the Draugr should slowly return to their graves. In the meantime, we'll stay in here until they go away. I curse the Covenant for what it's done. Thank you for helping us.